Lorain County is being inundated with drug-related cases. That's according to an Illyria judge, and tonight he's working to change that. Yeah, he's creating a new court to take the pressure off the criminal justice system and put it on the users to get clean. Kristen Vogue digging into the details of the drug court initiative. And Kristen, there's a real incentive for those users to participate. Chris, that incentive is to get their criminal case dismissed. Lorain County is starting its own drug court program, similar to the one in Cleveland, and the hope is to deal with the problem here that officials say is bad and getting worse. On the streets of Lorain County, this is what is easy to find, according to Lorain County Judge John Moraldi. Heroin and painkillers. I would say half of our criminal cases have to do with drug, drug possession. Uh, drug trafficking. Drug addicts are showing up in his courtroom again and again. Our standard supervision, our standard probation was not addressing the needs of these addicts. So Moraldi is starting Lorain County's first ever opiate drug court program. They, uh, in my opinion, are first and foremost addicts and uh, they may engage in criminal behavior but it's their addiction that's driving them. That program is voluntary, and law enforcement officials will refer addicts charged with drug-related crimes to it. If they do well and they advance through the phases, uh, the uh, requirements are three to four random drug tests per week. Participants will also get weekly drug and mental health counseling, plus a shot to ease their addiction and help with getting their GED. Ohio currently has 94 drug court programs throughout the state. The Reigns program, which will take about a year for participants to complete, will be paid for using existing county money. Live in Elyria, I'm Kristen Volk, News Channel 5.